Guys, I found a brand new strange Pokemon card product and we are about to reveal what's inside it. What's poppin' everybody, Dark Ghoul here, back at it again with another video. And in today's video, guys, we got a mysterious package in front of me. Pause on that. But guys, inside this package contains some of the strangest cards that I've never seen before. Or at least, that's what I think. And in today's video, we are about to unravel the mystery. So if you guys are excited... For today's video, y'all already know what to do. Smash the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And leave a comment down below with the hashtag Ghoul Army. But guys, let me show you what's inside this product. Because check this out. It is absolutely wild, my guy. But this is not all that we're opening up. We are also opening various TCG products including this one so here we go guys let's see what it is we got okay it looks like it is a charizard guys because y'all know everything about pokemon is charizard that's all there is to pokemon charizard 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 i'm kidding that's not all there is to pokemon but let me reveal the whole thing we got what is a that? golden collection Okay, with the rainbow background and the Charizard Gigantamax, I guess, if you want to call it. But check it out, bro. We got the Golden Collection. Now, I'm not sure what's inside this box. It could be, you know, like those golden cards that we've already seen. Or it can be something absolutely crazy, guys. But let's go ahead and flip it. We got the Kanto Starters. Okay, Squirtle, Charmander, and Bulbasaur. I'll take it. This box is pretty clean. But do the sides have anything? It looks like we got a pattern. We got rainbow. Just a bunch of rainbows everywhere. But guys, before we open this up, let's go ahead and prepare ourselves and open up some Verizon wireless boxes. This right here is the box we're opening up. They're actually $12.99 a piece at GameStop. I don't know how long they're going to stay like this, but... That is a deal and a half, bro. These boxes are normally 20 bucks. So let's dive right into it. But here we go, guys. Y'all know the drill. We got ourselves a code card. We got the Keldeo promo and the Verizon Wireless itself, which we are going to go ahead and sleeve up as well as the Keldeo because why not? You feel me? They deserve some love. But all these duplicate promo cards I'm getting... Best believe I'm going to give those away on my social medias. So make sure y'all are following me on the socials. But let's go ahead and open up a couple packs. And then after we open up this box, we're going to go ahead and reveal what's inside that mystery pack. You feel me? So here we go. First pack of Lost Origin. What do we got, bro? What do we got? We got a Lampent. We got a Damage Pump. We got a Rock Ruff. Roselia. Litwick, Spinarak, and we got a Trevenant Hollow. So check that out. And I did run out of penny sleeves. So Hollows will no longer be getting sleeves because I believe I am completely out, my guy. So we got Fusion Strike up next. A set that is near and dear to my heart, but it likes to treat me like trash. You feel me? I don't know what it is about this set. We got the Halucha. And the Araquanid. Okay, now we got Astral and Lost Origins. We're going to go ahead and jump right into Astral. Let's see what we got inside this pack. Can we get at least one pool per box? I'll be happy, but I'm not going to lie, bro. Y'all know my luck with collection boxes is trash. It is absolutely trash. And I don't know why I continue to buy collection boxes, bro. But we got the Mammoth Swine and... The final pack goes to this Lost Origin. Come on. Give us at least something more than a hollow, my guy. We got the Arc Phone. We got Miss Fortune Sisters, bro. We got a Manectric and... Nope. We got nothing. Well, it's a good thing I only paid 13 bucks. But y'all, 
Let's see what's inside this box. Let's go ahead and open it up. There we go. Okay, it looks like it's sealed up. You can feel the plastic wrap. And we got more gold cards, bro. Look at that. Oh my god, we got the strongest Pokemon card to ever exist. The Arceus VMAX with 10,000 hit points, my guy. 10,000 hit points, Arceus VMAX. That right there is absolutely god tier, my guy. Look at that. Look at that, my guy. Look at it! Look at it! Look at it! Look at it! And look at the moves, bro. One of them does 5,000 and the other one does 8,000, my guy. That is absolutely crazy. So let me go ahead and grab something to open this up because y'all know I'm going to take years to do it. So let's get it. All right, guys, here we go. Let's go ahead and see what I got myself into. So yes, they are gold cards, but I've never seen any of these cards so look at that. We got the Gyarados VMAX. Oh my gosh. With 3,000 HP. This ain't Yu-Gi-Oh, baby. It's time to do, 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 do. This is Pokemans. What else? And oh my gosh. These cards are like stuck to each other. I don't know what it is, bro. It's like they freshly made these. And they're like really stuck to each other. We got a red... Charizard VMAX with 800 HP. We got the Greninja All Blue with 800 HP. We got, oh my gosh, the Blue Charizard with 3,000 hit points. We got the Classic Charizard. This one is actually on the cover art right here. So that's where you know where they got the art idea. What else? We got, bro. We got Obelisk, we got Slifer, and Wing Dragon of Ra. That's crazy. Ooh, this Ho-Oh is beautiful. Hold up, this Ho-Oh is beautiful, my guy. Look at that. I'm not going to lie, they need to make this artwork a real thing. It would be so beautiful. And then we got a Shadow Lugia. That's crazy. We got the Mega Charizard. It looks like a Prism style art. And then what is this? All Rainbow Rare Gold cards, bro. Rainbow Rare Gold cards. After the crazy ones, we just got nothing but straight rainbows, my guy. Look at that. I'm not going to lie. The quality of these, look at that pattern in the back. Not the quality, but, you know, compared to the other gold cards I opened up, these are a hundred times better. I'm not going to lie, bro. Look at all of these rainbow rare gold cards. But I'm not going to lie. I was mostly excited about these VMAXs. These crazy cards that we saw in the beginning of this opening. But I'm not going to lie. These are low-key kind of crazy, bro. They are absolutely insane. Especially this 10,000 hit point Arceus VMAX. So guys, that was... What was inside this weird, strange, golden collection box? I'm not going to lie. Low-key, I was satisfied. 100%. But y'all already know that all of these cards that y'all see are not real. These are 100% fake cards. And you cannot trade these, sell these for money, and all of that jazz just an FYI. So guys, let's go ahead and put these back in the box and let's open up some more packs because the start of the show is looking lonely and it looks sad. I'm not going to lie. So here we go. We got three classic little Gardevoir packs because why not? You feel me? I bought these during the GameStop buy two get one free sale. So why not buy a couple single packs to test your luck? And getting, um, I don't know, maybe a Giratina, a $300 Giratina card. That would be absolutely awesome because I can cross that off my list for the master set. You feel me? So what do we got? What do we got? Ooh, baby. I skipped cards, but we got that Charizard, everybody. Look at that. The Charizard Trainer Gallery. Now, I know I did say I didn't have sleeves, but I do have sleeves 
for my ultra rares. I just don't have any for the hollows and whatnot. So here we go. Let's go ahead and sleeve that up. And let's open up the next pack. Maybe I chose the right packs. This GameStop had like five packs left. So hopefully all the ones I chose were the chosen one. You feel me? They were the chosen one. Here we go. Can we get something in the trainer gallery side? Maybe the red and Pikachu VMAX. We got a Pyroar and a Bufalon. Okay, absolutely nothing, but this final Gardevoir pack might have the juice. Even though the first one literally had the juice with that Charizard. So here we go. Next pack. And then we're going to jump into another box because those Verizon wireless boxes were going for around 13 bucks. So why not pick up a couple? You feel me? We got a seal. We got, okay. And we got a Honchkrow regular rare. All good. All good because it's not over. We got the second box right here and we going crazy. So here we go, guys. Here is the next box. Here is the code card. And y'all know they come with these promos right here and i'm pretty sure you guys already know the booster pack lineup by now so we're gonna save lost origin for last and we're gonna start things off with fusion strike you feel me so here we go come on fusion strike give me a mew baby give me a mew please bro give me a mew come on give me that alternate artwork mew i would be so happy we got a gomi we got a snubble geodude and, oh, I see something, guys. What is it? What is it, bro? We got the Blissey. And, oh, my gosh. I legit thought I saw Border, but I guess not. You feel me? I guess not. But we got ourselves a Hollow Dragapult. It's all good. I will take it, my guy. Astral Radiance up next. Does Astral Radiance have a Trainer Gallery set? I'm pretty sure it does. Or I might be straight tripping you feel me it might just have radiance i don't know we got a leafy on and we got the origin form dialga v i'll take it i will take it you feel me i actually do believe i need this card for the master set but it's not taking down the zard moving on into some lost origin everybody let's see if we can get something more crazy than that charizard bro let's see we got a Steel Energy. I'm not going to lie. I absolutely love Lost Origin. We got Ghastly. We got a Gumi. And we got a Drapion V. So this card right here is probably everybody's most hated card from Lost Origin. Don't get me wrong. Amazing Pokemon. It's just very annoying from this set. So here we go. Final pack of Destiny. What's inside, bro? What is inside the final pack of destiny, bro? Come on. We got the Lost Vacuum. Pseudo Wudo. We got the Pikachu. Shout out to my boy Pikachu. We got a Cast Form Trainer Gallery, bro. Look at that. That is absolutely beautiful, man. We got my boy teaching y'all about weather elements. Absolutely love to see it. Absolutely love it. But... What do we have on the rare slot? I slipped. I missed right there. I'm so bad. Let's try again. We got a Gallade Full Art, everybody. Check that out. We got a Dump. Baker. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. Hold up. We got to sleeve up both, but most importantly... The Gallade V has to be sleeved up because this is a card that your boy needed for the Master Set. But the Charizard remains king. And with that being said, guys, we did end up getting some decent pulls. I'm not going to lie. We actually got a lot of Ultra Rares, might I add, you feel me? Because I believe we only opened up like 10 packs and... This is already five Ultra Rares. We got promo cards, which makes it even more Ultra Rares and Hollows and all of that jazz. And on top of that, we get to figure out what was inside this strange box. And it did indeed contain the strongest Arceus card of all time. I'm kidding, bro. I'm kidding. Y'all already know this box right here was straight up just for fun. 
Without further ado, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the video right here, and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.